Yesterday, and also mentioned the contribution of um, Ulster Scots to American life. Um, was that was that ad libbed? Was it part of the script? And um, to what extent was that a deliberate attempt to placate some of his critics in Northern Ireland who see him as anti-British? So this is something that the president has spoken about before. If you look at his St. Patrick's Day remarks from a month ago, he made similar reference to Ulster Scots. Uh, I think the president is very aware when we are talking about immigration from the island of Ireland. That includes people from coming both from the, the north end and the south. And so this is something that he has spoken about before, uh, including very recently, uh, uh, as recently as, as a couple of weeks ago, and then also more broadly in, in speaking about his heritage, which, as he said, includes both both English and Irish elements. But yesterday morning with questions about whether he was anti-British, hated British, and then it came up in the speech. It looked like that might have been a, a specific response to the, the conditions in, in Northern Ireland that he encountered. I think, like I said yesterday, we were coming with a a very even-handed and balanced message, and I think if you look at the president's own track record, he has a history of engaging with unionist and nationalist leaders of British and Irish leaders. Uh, And and so I think that's what the president's track record reflects, and I think that's what his remarks uh, yesterday in his speech reflected.